Hello guys, welcome back to Shower Tips. In this video, I'm going to talk about how to fix Microsoft Wireless Display Adapter won't connect on Windows 10 after update and how to fix this up. So let's get started. So first thing is, what you have to do is just have to uninstall the driver. So to do this, you just have to open your PC, or else you can uh, click on this PC and go to Properties. Then on the left side, you just have to go to the left side, and there is Device Manager, which you have to select the Device Manager. And now from here, what you have to do is you just have to click on network adapters. And as you can see that we have many, you can uninstall from here. So this is the first step. After doing this, what you have to do is you just have to go here and you have to search for uh, Windows Update. You have to search for uh, Windows Update. You have to search for Windows Update. And uh, most probably you'll be getting the options to update. So you just have to update there. So uh, you have to click over here or go to settings in between you can directly go to settings Now from here you have to check for update and security and from here you can update go for updates Which is the first step. So this is what you have to do Moving on to the next one is all about you have to change uh, the uh, wireless uh, frequency I mean you have to change the wireless frequency band so uh, to do this you just have to follow the instruction which is you just have to you know you just have to follow the next instruction which I'll be giving you in the out so uh, to do this you just have to follow the instruction and also apart from that also I would like to make a notice you can sometimes if it's not working you can reinstall the graphic drivers so uh, most probably if in this case as you can see that I have already shown you once sometimes you just have to uninstall the graphic drivers and re reinstall it once again for example as you can see that on my display adapters it is AMD Radeon RX 5700 so if I have to uninstall once then after that you just have to reinstall back and most probably you know uh, the issue will be fixed and if it's not working then what we have to do is just have to follow the next instruction that is you just have to you know just make sure that you know that antivirus all, all things are disabled completely and you just have to make sure uh, you know you are connected to the adapters very properly these are some of the basic steps that I would like to make a notice and also you can uh, sometimes you know uh, reset the adapters can even also make a solution so you just have to uh, think about it also and also one of the basic step is most probably doing the up updating the latest things can be fixed the issue up and i hope these are some of the possible workarounds you can try out and if you have any notes regarding this do ask in the comment sessions we will get back to you and this is shahin officially signing off from get your tips keep practice social distance be safe and stay safe